with MMA KO, and I'm standing next to my main man right here, Mark the Machine Gun Matthews. What is going on, brother? Oh, man, just out here to watch the Young Bucks get down today, you know what I mean? Little cats paying dues, man. You got to give them their props, be here to support them, you know? Man, Rebel Fighter is bringing it down. We got a great amateur event. Let's talk about the next one. August 13th, the Machine Gun is bringing the guns. Tell us about that fight. Yeah, uh, they, they're lining me up. We're looking at a guy named uh, Micah Herbert. He's uh, three and three, fought overseas a couple of times. Uh, I've seen some of his fights on tape, man, and uh, he likes to bring it. So, I mean, it's going to be a fireworks fight for sure. I'm excited to be making this happen, man. Man, now you're excited. I mean, you now you had a fight that was happening. You did you have there was there was an injury. Tell us a little bit about that and how healthy and how you doing coming back from that. I'm good now. This is probably the first injury I've had that I actually took time off for. Uh, what happened is one day at wrestling practice, I shot on a guy. My knee hit a crack between the mats and bounced off the cement. What it what resulted was a pretty bad bone bruise right below my kneecap on the top of my shin bone. And it wasn't so much that it wasn't functional. It's just that if any contact got made to it, it would flare up, lock my kneecap in place, and I couldn't walk for the rest of the day. So uh, I'd take a few days off, go back in, aggravate it, a few days off, go back in, aggravate it. Finally, uh, my sports therapist was like, man, you're going to need about a month. So, like, it sucked to do, but I wasn't able to fight. As a result, the whole card didn't happen. I was supposed to be the main event, man. So, like, to all the other guys who didn't get to fight, Man, I apologize, and I hope I'm not the only reason, because I know a lot of people were getting ready. And to the opponent for that night, Joseph Videlis, I heard you're a stud, homie. I really want to get down with you, bro. So uh, maybe not this next fight, but the next Rebel Fighter, CFC, wherever, bro, we can get down. Homie, I seen you get down. I want. I know you'll bring it. Now, hey, you got a tattoo place. If you're, that's what you do. Tell people how they can get ink done by the one and only machine gun. Well, right now I'm at a Blasted Back Ink. We're in Old Roseville, 316 Lincoln Street. We've got a website, blastedbackink.com. If you want to get a hold of me directly, I've got my own website, manifestmark.com. Uh, I've got my web, or, uh, on my website, it's got my Twitter links, my Facebook links. You can email me there. I mean, all you got to do if you want to get in my chair is basically hit me with any kind of communication. Let me know what you want. We'll put it together and uh, you'll get inked nicely. You'll get blessed for sure. Now, you had a little bit of breaking news I seen the other day. Uh, some pretty great stuff. You want to put that out there as well? Yeah, yeah. Uh, starting uh, in January, I'll probably be moving out to the Bay Area. And uh, reason being is um, we're going to go get centralized with my wife's family a little bit. She's probably going to open a salon out there. She makes real good money, has a real good clientele out there to put herself in this position. And uh, I'm probably going to start fighting full time once that happens. So I'll, I'll still be tattooing. But I won't be tattooing for the bills. I'll be I'll be in the gym all day long. Right on, right on. Any final thoughts to all the people that support the machine gun? Man, like I said last time I was here, man, when I walk in and I see everybody and man, I hear the noise you guys make for me out here. Like it's all rebel fight. This is my Arco Arena right here. When I come here, it gets loud. Now I mean I'm blessed. Thank you. I know I put you guys through some ups and downs. If you've been following me game over i'm taking this shit serious I, i've been fighting for fun up until my last fight got to my last fight that's when things got serious my camp for my last fight that's why i got pre presented with the opportunity to have the main event fight at, at our gym the injury happened man that just made me more hungry you know what i mean like the, the little time off affected my conditioning a little bit all that's doing is making me push twice as hard. I threw up more than I've ever thrown up in the last week. You know what I mean? <laughs> but uh, that's just how I get down. That's how. That's why I, they call me the machine. He's bringing it. The machine gun. Stay tuned. August 13th. He is going to bring the guns into Rebel Fighter.